Hi there, I'm Jeremy and this is the Not So Berry Challenge, a challenge in The Sims 4 where you have 10 generations of Sims, each themed after a different color. We're still working on the Rose generation and it's Halloween. Well, let's go ahead and have Robin wake up because he really needs to go to the bathroom. Clementine's up too, to have her go use the toilet as well. And Arturo just became good friends with Rosie. I thought they were already friends. What's her enhancement level at? 100%. Looks like everybody is getting cake for breakfast this morning. Clementine got some cake. Robin got some cake. Rosie, why don't you clean out the fridge? And then we're going to have Arturo give you an enhancement after that. Oh, okay. You're doing it from across the room. All right. That's fine. Robin, let's have you get dressed for the day. And Clementine, let's have you get dressed too. Clementine, why don't you call over your grandma? There we go. Rosie is enhancement level six. She improved her durability. Very nice. And Listerina is here. Why don't you play some chess with your grandma? There we go. Rusty can get up and go get some food. He's feeling hungry this morning. He's also very happy because he's engaged to Ramia, and we are going to have their wedding in this episode. Robin needs to have a couple more boyfriends, go on a few more dates. I think it's time for him to break up with his boyfriend and move on to someone else. Let's invite Dominique over so we can break up with him. All right, Robin, go talk to Dominique here, and let's go ahead and break up. Does Robin have the non-committal trait? Has he self-discovered the non-committal trait? You know what? I think he has. Let's send Dominique home. Bye, Dominique. Rosie, why don't you go write your book? Rusty's going to work. Have a good day at work, Rusty. <laughs> Arturo, why don't you make a pizza? Go make a garden pizza. But Robin is now a single man. He needs to get out there and meet someone else to date. Oh, he's going to talk to his mom? Okay, she's leaving. Bye. Rosie, let's have you stop working on your book for now and come sell this uh, painting that you had made. She needs to complete an emotional painting. Okay. Oh, well, she just decided on a painting on her own. Small realism painting. Injury report. While working in the locker room, Rusty notices that the team's star player is clearly walking with a limp when no one else is looking. Should Rusty report the apparent injury to the trainer? Yes, report it. We got a performance gain from that. Pizza's done, Arturo. Go serve it up. Clementine's getting hungry. She can grab some of that. Let's sell that to the art gallery. Oh, it's a masterpiece. Well, there went her chance to do an emotional painting. It won't let her do one now. Go ahead and recharge. Um, uh, Clementine, here, why don't you go practice your science up here in your room? Go use your little science lab. There we go. Clementine is playing with her science set. She looks perfectly at home here. She turned on her music too. What kind of music is this? Spooky music. And there's someone at the door. Oh, it's a trick-or-treater. Robin, why don't you go help the trick-or-treater out? And go give her some candy. Let's have everyone get in costumes too. Uh, Robin can be Darth Maul. There we go. Oh, this is really nice. Meditating out here in the rain, but not getting wet because you're covered. Love that for you, Arturo. Clementine. We can have her stop experimenting and she can put on her Halloween costume. Uh, oh, there's only two costumes, a sausage or Yoda. Put on the sausage costume. Arturo, we're going to have you dress up as well. You're going to wear the Space Ranger costume. There you go. Rosie apparently loves wearing costumes, but she's a servo. Can she wear costumes? Oh, she can. Wear the Grim Reaper costume. Okay, I didn't realize servos could wear costumes. Cyrus is here. I'm gonna have Clementine go let him in. And he's got a gift for her. That's so sweet. Oh, it's this little collectible. Oh, and Rusty's home from work. Hi, Rusty. Why don't you put on a Luke Skywalker costume? There you go. And I think we should have a Halloween wedding. So let's go ahead and do that. Rusty, why don't you ask Arturo to be the officiant at your wedding? And you know what? This amusing trait that he has is just putting everyone's life in danger because it makes everyone very playful just from him being around. And I don't want Ramia to die of hysteria on her wedding day. So we're actually going to uh, change that trait. Oh, he got the loyal trait already. So that's fine. Let's just do that. Uh, Rusty can ask Robin to be the Sim of Honor. And Rusty, why don't you go ask Clementine to be your flower pal at your wedding? Yep, she said yes. It's already 10 p.m. on a Sunday night, though. Let's just do it now. Plan a wedding event. We'll just go to the pre-made wedding venue in Tartosa. I should really make more wedding venues for this game. Robin is over here hitting up Dante. Is Dante going to be your next uh, boyfriend? 
Maybe. Let's go do this wedding. I hate how they all sit on the floor. And then we're going to send down the flower pal. And then we're going to send down two Sims. And it's going to be Ramia and Rusty. Here they come. Oh, look at this. Isn't it adorable? They're exchanging their rings now. And are they going to kiss now? Oh, there it is. They tried, but they bumped heads instead. Oh, there's the kiss. Oh, they're blowing the bubbles out here while Ramia is taking a nap. Let's have Rosie come serve the food. Yeah, they exchanged vows. They blew bubbles. They did the spousal kiss and it didn't count any of that. I don't know why, but it didn't. Time to eat, everyone. All right, well, we've done everything that we need to do for the wedding. Robin, why don't you go ask Dante to be your boyfriend? He said yes. I guess let's go ahead and end the wedding. Everybody's trying to go to sleep. Just married. Would you like to move in together now? Okay. But Rusty and Ramia are not going to stay living in this house. We're going to move them out. So let's go ahead and have Robin pay the bills and then Rusty split from the household and move out. All right. You're going to take your new wife with you and we're going to just move you back into your parents' house. They're just going to inherit the parents' house, I think. So goodbye, Rusty. Goodbye, Ramia. Enjoy your life together. And we're back home with everybody else. It's 6 a.m. Oh, my God. People are going to be really tired today. Go ahead and sleep for a little bit, Robin. And Clementine can take a little nap, too, before school. And today is the first day of the holiday season. It's quite literally the day after Halloween. Put that food away. And let's have Rosie come work on her book a little bit. No, turn that off. There you go. I literally just turned that music off. All right, it's time for Clementine to wake up and go to school. Bye, Clementine. Have a good day. Same with Robin. It's time for him to wake up and go to work. I hope you got enough sleep. Arturo, do you work today? Oh, you don't. Rosie, work on your book. You're getting distracted by the music and you're not working on your book. If you turn that music back on again, I'm going to delete the radio. And there it is. Yeah, what now, Rosie? Write your dang book. Arturo, you can get up. What is love? We found an unsent love letter from Clementine to her teacher in her desk today. Nothing racy, but we thought you should know. Um, why is this Rosie's responsibility? Shouldn't they have called her dad? Oh, and tonight's going to be a full moon. Maybe that will uh, help him with his lifetime aspiration. In the meantime, here, Arturo, why don't you get some food? Are you going to sit down and distract Rosie while she's writing her book? Yes, you are. And now she's not working on her book anymore. Stop talking. Eat your food. And then why don't we have you prep some cookie dough? You're going to make cookies. And Rosie finished her book. It's excellent quality. Ooh, you can submit it to the Literary Digest. Yeah, go ahead and do that. Ooh, confident painting. I guess they can have their record player back. Yep, and she immediately turned the radio on as soon as I placed it. Clementine is home from school. Welcome home, Clementine. And she's now a B student. Her grades went up. She really needs to go to bed. Why don't you go ahead and just go take a nap real quick? There you go, Clementine. You'll be fine. Get some rest. Rosie, how's that painting coming? It looks nice. And Robin's home now too. Why don't you go take a shower and then you can go to bed too. Oh, and Rosie finished her painting. Oh, it's another masterpiece. Sell that to the art gallery. And then you can go ahead and recharge. Um, Arturo, why don't you collect your cookie dough? Yeah, there you go. And then go ahead and bake some sugar cookies with that cookie dough. Oh, and Listerina's here. Clementine has woken up from her nap. She's gonna go say hi to Listerina. She's gonna get some food. All right, Arturo made these sugar cookies. We're going to put them in the fridge. Clementine is eating. She was hungry. Oh, and Clementine is in the holiday spirit, it looks like. Talk about school with your grandma. After you do your homework, you can go to bed for the night. Robin, you need to wake up for a little bit. Yeah, you're tired. You're hungry. You got to use the toilet. I know. Clementine, why don't you ask Listerina for help with your homework? Here she comes. Beautiful. Robin wants to make a pizza, apparently. Oh, never mind. I tried canceling it, but he did it anyway. Yeah, and then you immediately go to the fridge to get leftovers. I freaking hate this pizza oven. I'm done with it. We're done with the home chef hustle stuff. All right, and she's done with her homework. Good job, Clementine. All right, go to bed, Clementine. You earned it. Robin, your needs are looking pretty good now. I think you can go ahead and actually, like, go to bed for real now, too. Arturo, groom yourself. And then we're going to send you upstairs to bed, too. Rosie, you need to self-repair. All right. Clementine is sleeping. Robin is sleeping. And Arturo is sleeping. I think I'm going to go ahead and end this video right here. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.